With summer coming up and the temperatures rising, what better business than the mobile ice cream truck? What we have here is a 2010 Mercedes-Benz Sprinter 3500. With only 200 miles, this beauty is in tip-top condition. So why don't we take a look at what's underneath the hood. With a 3.0 liter V6 diesel engine with blue tech, you'll be revving 188 horsepower and 325 pounds of torque. So with the Sprinter, you'll be maxing out at 20 to 24 miles per gallon, which is great because it gives you great fuel economy. Using the turbocharger alongside with the inner cooling system, you'll get all the power that you want from the Sprinter alongside lowering of emissions. So with the Sprinter by your side, you'll be getting not only the performance that you want, but you'll also do so with keeping the money in your pocket while filling up the tank. So the next thing about this car is that we discover all the great things that it has in it. So come on and let's check out what else we have. Starting on the driver's side, safety is very important. This vehicle is equipped with four disc brakes from the front to the rear, and it also encompasses anti-locking braking systems, or ABS. And that safety feature is set up on the vehicle itself, so where you're traveling, if there's any slippage on the road uh, due to ice, water, or oil, the system is designed to automatically adjust each individual wheel so you don't skid or yaw off the highway. It's a great important feature to have. Right here is a steel housing that encompasses the most important part of the vehicle, which is the generator. The generator is a Cummings Onan commercial grade generator that gives you up to 8,000 watts of power, which is very efficient for operating the entire kitchen. The water pump, the ref refrigerators, the air conditioning system, even inside of the cab itself. It is incorporated with 66 amps of power, which is more than enough power for you to connect up to any outside grid system and it allows you to get performance when you're utilizing it. Cummins is the world's largest generator company and also engine company manufacturing in the United States of America. It's a great company. Right on the side here are inlets that you can plug into if you're out at the park and they have plug-in ports for you at RV parks. This is great to have when you're outside on the road. We're going to close it and we're going to move on down to the other side of the vehicle for you. Also in the back here, we have size 16 tires here. They're mounted on a dual rear wheel system, which is very good for safety and stability when you're transporting items and personnel to e different events. It's great to have when you're driving this type of vehicle here. Right above and below on the side, we have two heat vent systems here, which allows you to dispel heat from the different appliances that are located inside of the vehicle. It's great to have these here so your machines can work continuously. Also, very important here, we have a fresh water inlet here. We'll allow you to do a couple of things here. There are two tanks that are built into the system. One's a 30 gallon fresh water tank system. The other one's a 45 gallon wastewater system after you've used uh, appliances and you've cleaned them. So it allows you to input using a regular garden hose right into the system itself to fill up both tanking systems in this unit here. On the other side, it says hose here. You can actually use that 30 gallon tanking system to connect the water hose here to wash the vehicle down when you are finished at the events that you're at if the vehicle is dirty. So this is great to have here, portable systems for your water. In the rear of the vehicle, located on the top of the vehicle, right under the red safety light is a rear view camera. That camera is used for a couple of things. One is the most important part of it is backing up with this vehicle here. It's great to have, it's a digital camera system that will allow you as you're backing up to see what's in back of you. And it's also used for security. If you're out and you're inside of the vehicle and you need to know that someone's back there, you can take a look on your monitor in the vehicle to see if there's anyone back here. And we're gonna also walk around the other side. On this side of the vehicle, this is the most important part of the vehicle. This is where clients are gonna come in and order their ice creams and snow combs here. But also, right at the top, we have two JBL 9-inch Marine speakers. They're great for music. And this is what's going to allow the consumers to come up to the ice cream truck because they can hear it. On the left side here, 
We're going to open the door. Pneumatic pistons here allows you to open it up and they'll stay up. You have plexiglass right here so you can see inside the kitchen. And on this side here you can order all of your ice creams and snow combs. We're going to close it down. And then the front side here, you also have a plexiglass and pneumatic piston system here where you can see the other part of the kitchen. That concludes the outside of the vehicle, and so we're going to look inside. Hi, I'm Ben Ritter, the car fitter, and I'm sitting inside of your new ice cream truck. It's a lovely two-passenger cabin Mercedes, and it starts right up. It's got a lot of very nice amenities, a CD player, AM FM stereo, an air conditioning unit that blows cold air, an automatic transmission, a handbrake, power windows, power mirrors, and power locks. It's also got a rear view camera right above, so you won't be running over anybody who's looking to get their ice cream. It's got a handy storage space here and plenty of headroom. Now in addition to that, it's got all weather flooring and a convenient toolkit. But let's be realistic. We're not here for the two passenger cabin. We're here for the cream. Let's take a closer look. Even if the road outside is rocky, the interior of your new ice cream truck is mint. Now let me show you all the features that it has. Right here is a master built refrigerated area. Perfect for your dipping. Up here you have some storage space, some working space, there's plenty of cabinet space down below. Here you've got your ice cream shavers, some more storage space, an air conditioning unit, some windows, and four fluorescent lighting fixtures. Over here you've got a cold and hot water sink and faucet, perfect for doing your dishes, keeping your hygiene up. And in addition to that, let me show you some things in the back of the truck. Okay. Now over on this side of the truck, you've got a water heater, which is how you achieve hot and cold water in the sink and the faucet. Now you've got a 20 inch workstation here, an opportunity to store your trash out of the way, and, and a refrigerator. Now this refrigerator here has 9.8 cubic feet of storage space inside. If that's not enough to keep the kids happy, and they start rocking the truck, you can make a getaway out of the back door. 